Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. The Santos faithful here giving it everything. It more than makes up for the relatively small capacity at this stadium. According to what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's 4-3-3. Uh, well, a system promoted by the rise of total football, Peter. The wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullbacks, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. They've got on the way here pretty promptly. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Yeah, Felipe Luis. He always puts in a massive shift, Peter. He chases lost causes, never seems to give up on anything. He's been known to keep some of the world's best wingers in his pocket, but there's more to his game than defending. He times those overlapping runs to perfection and to devastating effect. OK, interesting. over to the other flank he's made sure that that won't get through Gerson look at the defender bombing forward and that has been cleared has a hit a great save real class well as Tesco Peter the keeper has just received an A plus grade Oh, good interception. Santos have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Tries to dink it in. Too much on it. That's the keepers. Felipe. So the third of the match, or thereabouts, gone, and we still await the first goal. Looking for space out wide. Cut it out. Felipe. Felipe Luis. Sort of run down the left wing. Real chance! And he's there to cut it out. And the counter is on. He found his man. Got a throw in. Good challenge. He just stood firm. And it's Felipe. That's a corner. Yes, it is. Away from immediate danger.
He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. And he heaves it forward. He's gone out for a throw-in. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Yeah, that does look a foul, referee's given a free kick. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. The potential here for the first goal of the game. This certainly looks appetizing, well within shooting range. He's had a crack. Shoots! Oh, he got that all wrong. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. No foul, says the referee. Plays it out to the flank. Throw in. Tries to get it clear. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's got options out wide. Hoists it forward, done very well to intervene. And there's a long ball. And out to safety. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. So we reached the halfway point. Flamengo ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Already up and running for the second half. Flamengo playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Finds himself eased off the ball. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Try cutting inside here. And back out it comes. Into the box. Great leap! Really well taken goal. The breakthrough arrives at last. A great delivery and a finish to match. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the area department, this fella is definitely no sledge.
Santos take the lead. Oh, half time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. Looks to thread it through. And it's been taken straight back. Beautifully done. Delivers across. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Breaks on here. Flamengo have a free kick. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. the through ball gets the better of his man goes for goal it's anyone's ball it's on a plate chance to shoot he's had a shot and yes it's there He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. I doubt he'll score too many which come easier than that, Peter, but just look at his movement. He knew instinctively that the keeper would struggle to hold on to it. Flamengo grab the equaliser and we're all square. Well, they just couldn't have responded any better, Peter. Yeah, there's the old cliche about how teams can lose focus after scoring, but you still have to take your chances. Brilliant. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Felipe. Gabriel. Real chance! Sticks it away! And the game is well and truly turned on its head! A pretty simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. Flamengo take the lead. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Has it out wide now. And helps available out wide. Santos are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Oh, well.
well defended, that had to be done. Santos are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Looks to clip it forward. Flamengo are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. And it's played forward. Well, that's where he wants it. Going through. Oh, great defending. That needed doing. Look, ah, oh, he's given it away. Forward it goes. Flamengo need to hold on for a few more moments. And here's Gabriel. That is terrific skill. Shoots! Good, strong hand by the keeper. Good stop, that wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. It away. Well, what we're witnessing now just goes against the grain. They're not going to get back into the game like this. Deftly done. Chance! Has a shot! This could fall anywhere! Hit into the... And a header! Cross was inch perfect and the header unerring. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. And there goes the final whistle. Well, a game that had everything except a winner. Really watchable and honours even. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, a decent draw, Peter, with a good mix of action and plenty of talking points. And it ended with the right result, in my opinion.